How's it going movie fans? The 4th of April 2020 is 41 years since the birth of actor Heath Ledger. A BAFTA, Golden Globe and Academy Award winner, Ledger's debut film appearance came in 1992 with his true breakthrough performance coming in 1999. Tragically, less than a decade after that, Ledger's career would be cut short with his death in January 2008 but there are few who have managed to make such a large and lasting impact in such a short amount of time. Along with his wins, Ledger was also nominated for a further BAFTA, Golden Globe and Academy Award. Here are the Firewall's top 10 Heath Ledger movies. At number 10 is Ned Kelly. Based on the true story of Ned Kelly, played by Ledger, who would become one of the most infamous criminals in Australia's history. Following numerous clashes, Kelly and his family become involved in a bitter feud with the corrupt Victorian police force. The running time is 110 minutes, and Ned Kelly has the firewall rating of 6.6 .6 out of 10. At number 9 is Monster's Ball. In this romantic drama, widower Hank Grotowski is a racist prison guard who is forced to re-examine his racist beliefs when he falls in love with an African American woman. Ledger plays Hank's son, Sonny, a fellow correctional officer with a kinder heart than his father. The running time is 111 minutes, and Monster's Ball has the firewall rating of 6.6. .6. At number 8 is The Patriot. Set during the American Revolutionary War in 1775, widower, veteran and father of seven Captain Benjamin Martin is forced back into action when his eldest son Gabriel, played by Ledger, who joined the fight against the British, is captured and faces death. The running time is 165 minutes, and The Patriot has the firewall rating of 6.9. At number 7 is Candy. Dan, played by Ledger, is a poet, and Candy is an art student. The two fall madly in love, but their bohemian lifestyle and their growing dependence on heroin puts the pair on a roller coaster ride of emotion and the relationship on a path to destruction. The running time is 108 minutes, and Candy has the firewall rating of 7.1. At number 6 is Lords of Dogtown. Based on the true stories of a group of young surfers growing up in the Dogtown area of Venice Beach, California, who in the mid 1970s began to change the face of skateboarding. Ledger plays Skip, the owner of the Zephyr Surf Shop. The running time is 107 minutes, and Lords of Dogtown has the firewall rating of 7.3. At number 5 is Two Hands. In this comedy crime film, Ledger plays Jimmy, who is given the task of delivering $10,000 to a woman, but Jimmy finds himself in deep trouble after getting distracted, leading to two street kids stealing the money and going on a shopping spree. The running time is 103 minutes, and Two Hands has the firewall rating of 7.4. At number 4 is 10 Things I Hate About You. A performance which brought Ledger to the attention of a more mainstream audience, Ledger plays Patrick Verona, the bad boy in a Seattle high school who is paid to ask out Kat Stratford, which would allow her popular sister Bianca to also date. The running time is 97 minutes, and 10 Things I Hate About You has the firewall rating of 7.4. At number 3 is I'm Not There. For this unconventional biopic, a stellar cast was brought together in order to depict the many sides of music icon Bob Dylan's life and career. Ledger plays Jack Rollins, a young actor on the brink of stardom who falls in love with a French artist. The running time is 135 minutes, and I'm Not There has the firewall rating of 7.5. At number 2 is Brokeback Mountain. Ledger received Best Actor BAFTA, Golden Globe and Academy Award nominations for his performance as Ennis Del Mar in this romantic drama about two cowboys in 1963 who are hired to herd sheep in the Wyoming mountains, but the job changes their lives forever. The running time is 134 minutes, and Brokeback Mountain has the firewall rating of 8. At number 1 is The Dark Knight. Ledger posthumously won BAFTA, Golden Globe and Academy Awards for Best Supporting Actor for his performance as iconic villain The Joker, who the mob turns to in their hour of need in their attempt to rid Gotham of Batman. The running time is 152 minutes, and The Dark Knight has the firewall rating of 9.2. Thanks for watching, next week I'll be counting down the firewall's top 10 holocaust movies, don't forget to subscribe for more top 10s and reviews.